Hey guys, here Mark the Geek. In this video, I want to show you guys a very cool launcher called Themer. Uh, this launcher is in beta right now, and only people that are invited uh, with a special code can have access to this uh, launcher right now at the moment of this video. But let me go ahead and show you guys how this launcher looks so far. Um, like you can see here, the phone completely changes. It changes your home screen completely. Everything from the icons, everything from the home screen, from the draw, everything, every single thing, it completely changes. And it works, this is the Galaxy Note 3 and it works, everything works very good. Um, this right here, like you see, you can see the time. When you type on, on the time, it'll take you to whatever app you have assigned to it. Over here, if I call Miss Calls, it'll take me to the dialers. Uh, messages it will take me to the messages and um, keep in mind when you first install this for the first time they uh, it will ask you which um, message app you want to use which um, browser you want to use and from there you choose what browser you want uh, right now for example I got here um, Chrome launcher but if I want to change that let's go here to settings uh, let's go here to settings advanced desktop uh, no that's wrong it would be themer uh, preference. If I go to the browser internet and I want to reset that, I just click on that. It will, it will automatically reset. If I click over here, over here and SMS, it will also reset. If I go back, let's go back to the theme. If I go back to the theme and touch there, it will show me all the available browsers I have. Now I could go ahead and choose next browser instead of Chrome and voila, just like that. Very cool. Um, another thing you could actually do here is uh, like you see right here, these are folders as well. These are folders as well. And every folder has its different theme. Like for example, these are for games. Uh, these are for travel. Over here, you got your your social sites apps as well. Very cool. Everything is very very fluid. And honestly, for a beta, for a beta launcher, this app looks amazing. It looks amazing. Uh, here, of course, since I reset the message. I could go ahead and choose message and now it'll give me the message app too. Um, let me show you guys a very cool part of this launcher. If I go over here, tap right here, tap for browser, browse themes, most popular. From here I could go ahead, this is basically like a store, but from the themer alone. And it, it, everything is in different category. You got most popular, you got staff picks, and you got the newest themes here. And like you see everything, every single browser, every single theme launcher looks completely different, which is amazing. Uh, this one, let's go ahead and tap on this one. Let's go ahead and try for the first time. Uh, which is what well, something, one thing that's very cool here is that before you decide to install it, you can actually have like a preview of how the launcher would behave. Uh, you can also see the title of the pre of the of the launcher. Uh, you could uh, swipe up or down to see all the uh, the other launchers, like right here. I go and see this one. Let me see. Very cool. Look at this one. This one looks very cool with the Grand Theft Auto V theme, right there. Looks very nice. Let's go ahead and, and install this one since right now I've been playing a lot of Grand Theft Auto. So click right there. It doesn't take that much to, to set it up. It's very easily. And look at that. Look at that beauty. This looks simply stunning. Look at that. Everything, every single block right here, every single section, like for example here, got camera. Click here, will take you to the camera. Uh, maps, should take me to Google Maps, right? Yep, takes you to, takes you to the map right here. Um, what is this? Okay, email, you got messages, and like you see, they also have counters. If you have missing calls or missing calls or missing messages, you will also see the counter right there. Uh, click over here to the side, you got news, you got galleries, artistic, over here you got... Um, and you're going to pick up one...
Look at that. Like you see right there, I assigned my dog catcher to the player, which is awesome. Favorites, if we click here in favorites, you can also access your favorite apps. Um, to put an app as a favorite, it's very, very easy. For example, I could go ahead and put, uh, let me put an app here as favorite on uh, my fantasy football. I could go ahead here, right here, go ahead, click right there. Boom, and now it will appear in my favorites. So now it would appear here when I click there. Um, it has very, very cool. Over here, you can see the battery. The battery over here. Over here, I got some news from the game, which is very nice. Let's go back to settings. Let's go back over here. Let's go ahead and pick another theme. One of my downloaded. Uh, keep in mind when you first um, install this app, you, you're gonna have to log out, log in with account. It could either be a Facebook account or your Gmail account. I signed it with my Gmail account. That way, every every theme that you download will be right here. Like you see, you're gonna see here all your downloaded themes. Let's go ahead and click on this one. Go and click on that one to install that one as well. And look at that that looks very very beautiful um, here like you see you got over here you got a new a news feed which is very good because this works spot on this will automatically update and if you want to customize that the news you could just tap right here there's a little wrench manage feeds and from here you could go ahead and delete for example let me delete the finance because I don't like finance click there and you could add your own or RSS feed as well or you can import from Feedly as well if you use Feedly you can import your, your feeds from Feedly which is nice and a lot of other things over here you could also access your folders and you can also add apps to the folders if you're asking for example if I want to add this is the shopping folder if I want to add a app to the folder just click here uh, app store let me go ahead and put the app store there click over here okay over there and voila now I got the Amazon App Store right there awesome uh, so here um, keep in mind when you install this app and for example this right here is the weather and if you tap there um, if you don't have the app that it needs it will take you to the App Store that way from here you could go ahead and install it so this is the weather channel app that this uh, themer use um, and I've noticed that almost every 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 single home screen requires the weather channel which is good because um, some um, applications like for example from buzz launcher has different home screens as well and the bad thing about that is that different apps requires different weather apps which sucks because I don't like having a lot of weather apps in my phone or well, here click here boom it should take me to my to my weather channel okay click there okay since this is the first time I log in so it will show me all that initial setup but like you can see this is just amazing here in El Paso click there nice very awesome of course over here like you see the the, the notification is hidden but if you click right here in settings uh, click here in settings click here in advance desktop you can also um, enable the notification browser or you can auto hide the notification browser if I go back 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 okay now you're gonna see the the notification available all the time that's if you really want that and like I said everything here is working very very smooth very smooth very surprised if they didn't tell me that this was a beta honestly i wouldn't believe it but it is in beta which is amazing looks very smooth and this is man this is the beauty of android this is the beauty of android you can make your phone look however you want to without rooting without jailbreaking no matter what phone you have, you can make it look completely different, which is the beauty of Android. Let's go back again. Let's go ahead and choose another theme so you guys can enjoy over here. Uh, let's go ahead to most popular. Uh, this one looks very cool. Let me go ahead and download this one. 
I don't think. You can also favorite or apply. If I click favorite, it will always keep it in a different section there. But let's go ahead and apply. Okay. Um, of course, uh, depending on the phone that you have, it might take a little bit longer to set up everything. Uh, right now, this is the Galaxy Note 4, and it's pretty powerful. So the loading, like you see, the loading of the themes is doing it very, very fast. Maybe, I don't know if that's the reason why this is going so fast or so smooth. But it looks, you know, it's everything's running super, super smooth here. Look at that. Goes to my Flipboard. Goes to your map. Looks very awesome. And like I said, if you want to assign a different news app, you could go ahead and, and, and delete it, reset it, and assign a new browser, new news app. You could assign a new browser as well. It will always remember. That's another good thing about this themer. It will always remember if you choose browser as your def as Chrome as your default browser, and you change from themes, it will always remember that you chose Chrome. Over here, you can see the time over here in the bottom. And look at that. I could tap there, and it takes me to the alarm. If I tap over here, it takes me to my battery. Look at that. 16 hours and 2 minutes without uh, on battery. Awesome. <laughs> and over here, you got your news feeds as well. And over here, I got my player. Over here, if I tap right there, it will take me to Google Music. Not bad. This looks very cool. Tap right there. It takes me back to the home screen. Like I said, this is in beta. And right now, it's free to use for those that are invited with the special code. And um, when it finally comes out, I don't really know if there's going to be a price for this app. I truly think it will be a price for the app, this app. And I'm telling you right now, if it's $4, $5, $6, $8, no matter what the price is, I will buy it. I think this is going to be a must-buy app. Because look at this. It totally changes your phone. It totally changes your phone. It feels like a new phone. Look at this one. This one looks very cool. This one totally changes your phone as well. Look at that. That looks very good. This one has no other pages, like you see, because that's the, the way it was made to be. Look at that. Look at that. Over here, you got the camera. I think I I think I've explained frick pretty well how this app works. Look at that. That looks awesome. Very good. Phone. Nice. Takes me over here too. Should take me to the clock. Yeah, very cool. Over here. I like the fact that it has the draw right here. Looks very cool. And another thing, since this is the note, guess what? Even the stick works. The S Pen works perfectly here. And I could go ahead and screen write. Look at that. And look at that. Ha 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 ha. Very cool. And I could go ahead and save. And that's it. So and for the, so you can see that even the buttons work. Voila. Very good. Very beautiful. So I think this right now is going to be the launcher that I will be rocking for a while until this actually comes out from beta. And when it comes out from beta, of course, there should be a lot more themes available. There will be a lot more themes available. Like you can see, there's a bunch and bunch of themes available here. Even look at this one. This one looks freaking awesome. And look at that for, for Breaking Bad fans. That looks awesome as well. Look at that. Jesse, Walt. And like I said, this is in beta. A lot of developers are still uh, uploading um, themes here. There's going to be new themes every once in a while. And when this finally comes out of beta, most likely there will be a lot more. And uh, most likely all the themes from right here are going to be free, most likely. But I totally expect this to be a paid app because um, it's that good. It's simply that good. And I think the developer... And all the team that's doing, working on this app totally deserves it. Look at this. This looks amazing. So, guys, that's it. Just wanted to give you guys a, a fast look at the Themer app, which is in beta, 
on the Galaxy Note 4 3. Till next time, guys.